Jacob could be on the horizon in the Virginia House of Delegates. Right now, the balance of power favors Republicans by a slim 51 to 49 margin. But next month, a GOP delegate will retire, opening the door for a possible shift. 13 News Now reporter Jacqueline Lee looked into the likelihood of that happening. David, our political analyst says it's highly unlikely given that the delegates district is a Republican stronghold. However, given low voter turnout, it is within the realm of possibility that a Democrat could take over. After delegate Greg Habib announced he's retiring, 13 News Now political analyst Quentin Kidd said there's a lot at stake in the razor thin Republican majority House of Delegates. It'll be a battle, battle over who gets to spend what is what is probably going to be close to a billion extra dollars. Kidd says delegates will want to use that money to advance the interest of their constituents going into an election year. So the battle will soon begin over which party will take control of that seat. On paper, I don't expect this to be a really competitive special election. Habib's district historically votes Republican. It covers Roanoke, Montgomery and Craig counties, as well as Salem. According to the Virginia Public Access Project, in the last 11 state wide elections. Voters chose Republicans each time, with GOP candidates winning no less than 56% of the vote. House Speaker Kirk Cox will soon announce a date for the special election. Kidd says if Cox decides to hold it in late August or September, that Republican stronghold could possibly flip. Then all bets are off because uh, you're talking about a, um, you know, dog days of summer election. Turnout is going to be really low. House Democratic Leader David Toscano requested the special election coincide with the November general election because he argued it's the most fiscally responsible. Jacqueline Lee, 13 News Now.